The main thing about establishing your own database is that you own it. You also should back it up. So download um, a, a copy of it onto your own computer so that it can never be lost if anything happens. Sure, you've got a database from people that follow you on social media, but anything can happen on social media. You could lose your social media page because of some reason. The social media platform could change as Facebook has done where they're now limiting the amount of people that you can get to who've liked your page. So your database that you have that's connected to your website is the most valuable database. And the ways that you can entice people to sign up on your website is by, is by placing the sign up form in a place that they're likely to see it. The optimal place is the top right hand corner of your website because it's naturally where your eye goes to when you first open up a website. It's the first place that people see. That should be really clear it should be designed in such a way that it catches people's attention and the best way to get people to sign up is to give them an offer for doing so. So by saying sign up to our monthly newsletter or weekly newsletter will not do it. Most people are trying to get rid of newsletters out of their, their email because they're cluttering up their, their email and their inbox. So what you might like to do is to put together something like a top 10 tips for your business and do it as a PDF and set it up so that when once they've signed up to your database, they get a link to where they can download that product. Um, you could do all kinds of things. It could be something that you send them. It could be a sample that you send them. But give them an incentive to sign up. Use something that has something to do with your business. Don't get them to sign up for a, a product that has nothing to do with your business. That product should also market your business and give them more information about your business and establish your reputation as a trustworthy expert in your field. So I can't emphasize how, how important it is not to overinvest in social media to the point where your entire database are your Twitter followers, your Pinterest likers, your Instagram followers. Make sure that you have it somewhere safe.